Well, in this experiment, we start from a neutral sheet of plastic. It doesn't have any charge. It doesn't deflect the electroscope. And a neutral aluminum disc. We take a piece of felt and rub the plastic sheet with it. Now it's supposed to be charged. Let's check it out. Yes, it has a charge. It deflects the arm of the electroscope. We put the aluminum disc on it and we touch the disc. Interestingly enough, now the disc also has some charge. And we use it to charge the electroscope by induction. Now let's use the lamp, which is on, the green light is on, and bring it close to the plate of the electroscope. Nothing is happening. The electroscope keeps its charge. Well, so let's discharge it and try the experiment again with a little difference. So we are rubbing the plastic sheet with felt. We put the disc and attach it. But now we rub the disc over the plate of the electroscope. And now we use the lamp. And the electroscope loses the charge completely. And all charge is gone. Why? Well, we can repeat a similar experiment. Same sheet of plastic. We just want to rub it with fur. Now we use a large aluminum disc to put it on the sheet. The sheet is charged. The disc is neutral. We put the disc on the sheet, touch it, and now we use it to charge the electroscope by induction. So we bring it close, we don't touch the plate, we touch the bottom of the electroscope with a finger. The electroscope now has some charge, and uh, well, not much, but it has. So what kind of charge is it, positive or negative? Well, you should know the answer by now.